There was one that relinquished his time. And I cut mine very short because of your time constraints. I have much more to say. Um, John Lyles, 502 South State Road 145. So recently, uh, <coughs> could make my last payment yet to do it up until my uh, account. And I just uh, think many people have said uh, most of it. I'll read it. I think it's right now. It's, it's obvious this isn't a good idea. Um, and uh, one, the only thing I, I, I would add is that I, I just I just can't understand why you would tell the workers that, that, that it seems to me that they better are in the position of thinking that they need the biomass to have a full time position to feed their families and the like, and I just don't get that. Um, because you seem to be spending plenty of money on other sorts of things, uh, exploratory things, and the like, that it seems like they should be able to have full-time employment to be able to make their make their uh, livings here. I think that there's plenty of money to be <coughs> made with uh, getting true green energy, solar panels, building wind turbines, harnessing the power of the Pachoca River, making the building more energy efficient. So I do applaud the fact that you are seeking federal subsidies. I think the only way that we're going to get out of the mess we're in is with federal subsidies. Otherwise, we just keep going along the way we're doing. And right now, Du Bois County, Indiana, is the 36th most air-polluted county in the United States of America. And that doesn't seem good. So I think those points have been pretty much made, except I want to speak for the workers. I think that, they, that, they, that there's ways and there's jobs for them to get full-time employment, not just 32 hours that probably is a hardship to them. But I also think I can offer and you probably thought of this offer, something I saw in a campaign literature, to let you get this off your plate so you don't have to be the ones deciding. And you could just let the people decide. In November, you have an election coming up. Why don't you just make a referendum, have the referendum go through, and let the people decide in November. <laughs> democracy and I don't think that you of it want this on your conscience. And I think you can let this happen with letting the people decide. It's simple. It's very simple. Let the people decide. <laughs>